medium that I work with in painting is watercolour and the reason for that is there is a kind of magic that you get with watercolour that you can't, well I haven't found I've been able to get that with acrylics and there is this level of losing control and spontaneity and a lightness that you get in watercolour. So that's probably the main reason, even though a lot of people will say watercolour is probably one of the hardest painting mediums to master. I think once you actually learn the different techniques to control watercolour, it actually becomes quite satisfying to work with this medium. The, the subject matter that I paint with, animals, really lends itself to watercolour. There is that lightness there. I spend a lot of time painting birds, so that lightness with birds. I live in an environment where the colour of our environment is very intense, so I can go from very soft, mellow watercolours to very intense, strong colours all in that, that same piece. And today we're going to explore the tonal range that you can achieve in watercolour and we're also going to have a look at a number of different uh, techniques and effects that you can get um, and discover the magic that I find in watercolour and hopefully you'll actually pick up some of those tips that will make your journey into watercolour a lot easier. If you like this video, find more watercolour painting techniques here and subscribe to Channel NT for more workshops from Northern Territory artists visit channelnt.com.au.